Back in 1999, there's a guy by the name of Dr. Robert Ballard. He's known as like the underwater, he's an arche underwater archaeologist. He found the Titanic. He found the Bismarck. He found the USS Yorktown. He's very famous. It's kind of seen as like the underwater Indiana Jones. And he took a submersible because he went with a theory that came out of the Ivy Leagues that said, we think that there was a flood that was so significant that it overwhelmed the Black Sea and turned the Black Sea from freshwater being an isolated lake to where the seas rose and inundated it with all of its salt water. So the Mediterranean flooded into the Black Sea and turned the Black Sea salt water. So he sent Hercules, his underwater submersible, to go down on the floor of the Black Sea. And in 1999, listen to this, he discovered a shoreline that was 550 feet underwater. Okay. And all of the, the fossils that dated 7,000 years or older were all freshwater. They were all freshwater species. All of the species and fossils that came after that were salt. And as they're looking around 311 feet below sea level, you find the, the wattle and daub structure, the corners of buildings, you find tools, ceramic, stone tools of a hammer and an axe. And so here you see evidence.